My name is Jose Cosme, and I am a, a fine arts major here at Our Lady of the Lake. I'm also a practicing artist, and I have a space at Guys the Gallery. As far as inspiration, uh, I'm very open-minded, so pretty much everything inspires me. I find beauty in everything. Uh, I try not to limit myself. I do some things that might be addressing social issues uh, or some things that are just funny to me. Uh, icons I grew up with on both sides, uh, American and the Chicano or Mexican icons like Chapulín Colorado or Cantinflas, um, revolutionary images, uh, icons like Zapata or Malcolm X. Yeah. I know, I'm, I'm inspired by everything. Uh, well, before I got involved with San Anto, I, I painted murals before, but I wasn't really serious about it. I was back in high school and... Uh, <laughs> I don't want to incriminate myself, but I would get paid and go spend the money on things I sh probably shouldn't be spending on it. But, um, like I said, I became in San Anto. I, I started uh, volunteering, helping others do their murals. And finally, I got a chance to work on my own mural. And that would be the San Antonio College uh, mural in the Fiesta Room. It was commissioned by the Hispanic Heritage Committee and um, they wanted something in the Fiesta Room and you know I was already familiar with a lot of the Mexican history or Chicano history so I kind of did a timeline and I was just trying to put that information out there because I know a lot of times uh, people don't they're not really familiar with their history as far as us being Chicanos or of Mexican descent so I pretty much did a timeline focused on you know different cultures starting with the Olmec civilization the Aztecs uh, the coming of the Spaniards um, moved on to the Mexican Revolution to the more contemporary figures uh, as far as um, like Andy Benavides, Joe Lopez, people like that established artist which was another source of inspiration for me meeting these people that were working and I was just pretty much feeding off of that energy that creative you know energy that they were putting out there so I've been there a few years now and I've seen people come in and out, you know, all kinds of work um, I used to work for Andy too and while working there, I also I, I also saw a, a lot of work go through there. So <laughs> it's kind of funny because I didn't have to go to museums to see this work, you know. I don't really remember anybody pushing me to be an artist, but it's 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 who I am. It's not. I mean, nobody had to tell me like, okay, you should do this. Go to go to college to be an artist. It's 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 who I am.